Oh goodness, this man's entire worldview is about to collapse. Hi guys, it's Janae and welcome back to my channel and today I am doing a new first impressions to an ongoing show that just started airing on Netflix but it's been ongoing for a while now on other sites. It's called Love is a Poison and it, it looks questionable but I'm intrigued. Like it kind of is giving me my beautiful man or my personal weatherman kind of vibes which are on the the stranger side of the spectrum but always end up winning me over and have a very interesting dynamic going on so that's what i'm hoping for going into this we'll see how it goes i hope you guys will enjoy it before we do get into it however i just want to say a quick and say thank you to all my amazing patrons and channel members and if you're interested in joining either of those for uncut and exclusive reactions to things like this, links will be in the description below along with my social media and my peer box. Now with Arf Adri, let's get into today's video. Ah! Oh no! He seems like a hard to please man. <laughs> Just somehow I feel like his reality is about to crash around, down around him in the form of a partner that he thinks he cannot at all work with. Oh? Oh? <laughs> okay? Not what I was expecting. Okay, I forgot to mention. Basically, I checked the summary for this a while ago before it started airing. It sounded interesting. And now I'm just trusting that past me had judgment because I can't remember what it's about. Okay. We'll see how you feel about that once you, it starts affecting you. I don't think it's that. <laughs> I mean, that's not that bad. Can you be sued for jobs you do while be just being a legal representative? I think you can, but I think it's pretty difficult. Uh-huh. So he's gonna pretend to be a very caring person. これ、エルミスだよね。いいの。もちろんです。自分が得をすると思えば相手を攻撃しない人というのは本当に愚かで滑稽な生き物。<笑> <いいの。笑> You're also a human, just remember that. Ah! I mean, that's what you wanted him to think, right? Arigato. san Ah! What was that visual? Oh goodness, this man's entire world is about to collapse. <laughs> Love that all of them are succulents. <laughs> I don't know, you seem very close to your plans, are we sure about that? Special 
comment Suddenly my comment doesn't feel like as much of a joke. <laughs> you just murdered you. Well, not murdered, but like mishandled your pawns. I love how he's not nearly as competent as he thinks he is. Oh great! The very person you were trying to clear your head mind of. Yeah, I'm starting to think it's planned. Wait, what? But he thought that. He didn't say that, though, right? <laughs> Just go with the first. Eleventh? He seems incredibly good at reading this man, uh, which I'm very intrigued by. I kind of wouldn't mind if there's like a weird low-key um, fantasy element to this, but I don't think that's the case. I think he's just good at reading him. But how are you that bad at camping if you've done it 11 times already? To be fair, he got to this point, so I guess it's not all bad. <laughs> the imagery, oh my goodness. さすがええご覧区の特級品。誰が焼いてもうまい。わあ。どんな高級店でもこんなうまい肉は食べたことがない。こいつ。一体何者なんだ。いや、I'm Meet at the office though? Honestly, I'm starting like I believe that. I don't now that he said it, I don't actually believe it, but I was wondering if that was gonna be part of the story because of how accurate he is about it. This man looks so unnerved about this encounter, it's kind of hilarious. No, I'm hungry, damn. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Wait, what? Okay, that wasn't what I was expecting. I thought maybe they'd he meet each other at work. Alright. Can you maybe see him in the back there? Can you maybe try and hide a little better? Or angle the camera slightly differently? Seriously? <laughs> How creepy! Please tell me your family has supernatural abilities because otherwise, how is your mom smelling you? Well, I mean, considering how much he's been putting up with, I'm starting to actually believe that. Mm. What, for the scratch? 
ここで火を起こしてもらい肉を焼いてもらってカレーを返すためだ。You don't have to say that out loud. What if he hears you? Wait, 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 huh? No, 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 no. Oh, okay. He said he'd explain in the morning, and now he's gone. Um, I thought you were a lawyer. Like, if it were me, I would be trying to utilize some of my connections to maybe find my car or find the guy so I could follow up about the disappearance of my car. But maybe that's like part of. The sign that he likes the guy is that he's not even thinking in that direction when he's been painted to be pretty ruthless about things like that so far. You don't just steal people's cars and then come return it. What the hell is going on? When? No. He maybe thought about it at that point. This man is very weird. No clue. What? And just because everything else wasn't bad enough. Okay, so that was the first episode, and that was wild. That was, but <laughs> I don't know how to feel about that. Like on the one hand, very wild, very strange. Um. On the other hand, it's weird in a way where I want to find out what's up with the rest of it, if that makes sense. So, I don't think there's any supernatural elements actually going on. Though I would totally be here for a mind reading, you know, kind of in the same way, way where Cherry Magic had only the mind reading being a supernatural element and everything else was normal. I'd be up for that kind of a situation because I think it could be fun, but I don't think that's the case. I think he's just very perceptive and using his power powers for nefarious purposes. We'll see. I'm not a hundred percent sure on the revelation that we got here on the at the end. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to know or if it's something that like they've hinted at, but we'll get the puzzle pieces fully later on. Um, but what I'm assuming is that he had that woman as a client, he helped her take down the people that she had an issue with and now because this guy was part of the, that group he kind of has a bone to pick with him. Not 100% on that, we'll see. Very interesting, I think this is gonna push some of my comfort boundaries but we take the show as seriously as it cues us to be taken so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought because this is interesting and hopefully if this does well i'll see you in the next one bye